On Saturday, June 6, the Dayton Lady Dutch Lions hosted the Lady Silverbacks of Atlanta. The Lions would come out aggressive, taking the lead following an own goal by Atlanta's Mary Bleak Road. Josie Stever was looking for Florence Dadson in the box, but when the ball got by Dadson, the Atlanta midfielder's momentum carried her and the ball into the back of the net. Four minutes later in the 16th minute, Dadson was at it again, this time connecting off a cross sent in by Ode Fulu Tudilu. Dadson whipped in the ball past the right hand side of the keeper who had no chance of stopping the ball. At the half, the Lions held on to a 2-0 advantage. Opening up the second half was Megan Blank in the 62nd minute when she burst down the center of the pitch, chipping the Atlanta keeper and placing the ball on the far post. The Lions would tally two more goals, first in the 71st minute when fullback Eugene Nugent sped past the Silverbacks defense, placing a rocket in between the keeper and the near post. That was followed by an 86 minute goal by Liz Slattery who shot the ball off the crossbar and bounced it into the opposite corner. Atlanta would eventually score one of their own when in the 90th minute a letdown in the Lions defense gave Chloe Richards the Silverbacks lone goal. Following the final whistle, Dutch Lions TV caught up with head coach Gavin McLeod to get his thoughts on the match. Uh, after last weekend, we kind of spoke about the need to play at a greater tempo. Um, obviously, looking to create more in and around the top of the box. I think working on that all week in practice, I think we finally got back to translate early on in the game here. We knew Atlanta were going to come in. We had a hard game yesterday against Charlotte. We had the bus journey up, so we wanted to really start the game off on the front foot. We did that, you know, we came out, we played fast, we had a good tempo, we had good movement up top and we had four or five early chances.